Hello guys, he is Snip here again. So I have, I have, I have asked a question uh, yesterday. Why do we need drip loops for service entrances? And we've got numerous question, numerous answers regarding that. Uh, let's check the answers. Okay, let's start with Lame Lang. Uh, his answer is to prevent water from entering into the service entry or weather head. So that's a check for me. And then for RD11784 to allow moisture to drain away from the weather head. So yeah, that's great. I like the answers too. Um, to keep water from entering the conduit. Yes, Sparky Troy already got the answer to them. SM Brownie to support the mass from falling over. Well, probably uh, it's it could be it could be, but the main purpose of that is to really for the rainwater to have some some area to drop on. Okay, then also for Mark Rebel, of course, Mark Rebel. That's a Mark Rebel. So yeah, that's a great, no water, basic, okay. Uh, I just have to check out the post here. Let's check our previous post, okay. So for example, the water is going to flow here. Since it is a lower point on this side here, the water flows here. Instead of going here, no, it just goes down, so yeah check drip loop are needed for it and it's required okay thanks everyone so i hope you learned something new today thanks